Now, you know what's interesting about the NIE? It, uh, it was an intelligence report done last April. Uh, as I understand the conclusions, uh, the, the evidence uh, on the conclusions reached was stopped being gathered on February, at the end of February. And here we are coming down a stretch of an election campaign, and it's on the front page of your newspapers. Isn't that interesting? Somebody's taking it upon themselves to leak classified information for political purposes. I talked to John Negroponte today, the DNI. You know, I, I, I think it's a bad habit for our government to declassify every time there's a leak because it means it's going to be hard to get good product out of our analysts. Those of you who've been around here long enough know what I'm talking about. But once again, there's a leak out of our government. Coming right down the stretch in this campaign. You know, to create confusion in the minds of the American people, in my judgment, is why they leaked it. And so we're going to, uh, I told uh, the DNI to declassify this document. You can read it for yourself. We'll stop all the speculation, all the politics, about somebody saying something about Iraq. You know, somebody trying to confuse the American people about the nature of this enemy. And so uh, John Negroponte, the DNI, is going to declassify the document as quickly as possible. He declassify the key judgments for you to read yourself. And he'll do so in such a way that we'll be able to protect sources and methods of, uh, that our intelligence community uses. Uh, and then everybody can draw their own conclusions about what the report says. Thank you. Why? Why is decla what was that question? Why would is that declassification not a Because I want you to read the document so you don't speculate about what it says. You asked me a question based upon what you thought was in the document, or at least somebody told you was in the document. And so I think, Jennifer, you'll you'll be able to ask a more profound question when you get to look at it yourself. <laughs> As opposed to relying upon gossip. And somebody, you know, who may or may not have seen the document trying to classify the war in Iraq one way or the other. It's, uh, it's just, I guess it's just Washington, isn't it, where, you know, we kind of, uh, there's no such thing as classification anymore, hardly. And, um, but anyways, you all take a look at it, and, uh, and then you'll get to see. <laughs>